night, guys. 6.30 in the morning, I get up, truck loaded, <clears throat> get going, look down at my gas gauge, and I got like 15 miles of fuel left, so <clears throat> I hope that is not indicative of the way this morning is going. The skies are kind of gray on the horizon, like that rain might be moving in at some point. Let's hope we get the day in. Tim's coming out to run a scraper again. I got uh, Sean Harold coming out to help us up. He's a 150 kid that helped get into the union. He's got a day off. <clears throat> He's a member of the club. So we'll come out and help. So we're going to do that. <clears throat> I got the survey guy coming out today to uh, to do a bunch of staking up there. I need him to stake the berms, the parking area, the ranges, ditch line, and the rest of it I can figure out. Got to have him put in some hard marks on the piers, on the covers so on the hundred <clears throat> and up there on a the 50 foot bay maybe even on a block wall somewhere I've got a hard etched control point that's not gonna move it's not a stake somebody's gonna run over I'm gonna have them stake out the center line of the main bar that's divided between the new ranges back there on the east side because I think we got a plan so we don't have to double haul a bunch of dirt. If we can make that one work out, then I think we'll be in pretty good shape. We got a mechanic coming out to look at one of the scrapers. It's giving us an issue with the hydraulics <coughs> on a couple of circuits. See what that looks like. So, Bob can't make it today. Dave's out with a medical deal. So, I get my first time in the eight today pushing the scrapers. We'll see how it all runs, but we get we got to pick up that pile of black and median that I left last weekend start there if I can keep all the members from parking in the way that'll be the big thing I'll see Somebody's going to see those big green machines and that those are climbing that hill right there next to the parking lot. They're going to want to park close to us. And I left one of the cameras in a camera in the D5 over the weekend, so I didn't have that video to edit. And this mount seems to be just a wee bit shaky with this other camera. Well, that'll get us going. I need another Diet Coke. We'll catch you out there in a bit.